Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another video. So today we are once again going to do a video that I think in 2023 is very much needed. The price of everything is going up. The cost of living is probably more than it's ever been. So I'm sure a lot of people can use new ways to make money. So I have once again gathered new ways to accomplish that. And we are going to go through all of them today. And I think I have the perfect one to start off with. This one is a little specific where it might not apply to everyone, but overall it's a good idea and could be very motivating. Because there's a couple services out there that will simply pay you to just lose weight. Found this site called Healthy Wage where you basically set your fitness goal, how much you wanna lose over how many months, and just like that, they give you an estimate of how much your payout can be if you accomplish that goal. So this could really be easy money and you get in shape. That's a win-win. But of course there's a catch to this where you have to bet a certain amount of money every month where you'll get paid more than you put in if you lose the weight. But if you don't lose the weight, you also lose the money. <laughs> Which is kind of messed up. It's like a double whammy because then not only are you just gonna, you stay fat, but then you also got robbed. So I went through the whole signing up process and it does seem legit. It seems like you can actually make a pretty good amount depending on how much you bet. There's actually a few of these kind of services out there. There's another called Diet Bets, which is nicer because you really don't have to put in as much money. And Diet Bets is nice because I think you get to join the challenge with a bunch of other people where all the money goes in a money pool. And then I think you get the profit off the people that fail the challenge. I would almost personally sabotage people. I would be sending people in the group food porn. I would be sending them coupons to McDonald's. And that sounds messed up, but it's a good business move. Now for these videos, I typically like to actually test the ways that I talk about, but I can't test this one because I don't need to lose weight. In fact, I'd want to gain weight. And you can't do that kind of fitness journey on here. So overall, I realistically think this is a pretty decent way to make some extra money because it's really on you to put in the work. But it might not be for everyone because everyone might not have the time or even a lot of losing weight is diet and people might not have the money to be able to get all the healthy food that they need. By the way, I need to mention this. This probably only annoys me, but on Healthy Wage, their website, why is this Photoshop so bad? Why is the background going into her neck? This is such a bad Photoshop job. It annoys me. But moving on to the next weird way to make money. And this very much might be the weirdest way I have in any video. Before we get to that, we need to thank the sponsor of this video, Surfshark VPN. I'm sure most of you by now know what a VPN is, but if you don't, it's a program that provides a virtual private network that allows you to browse the internet while having your info and data protected. And we all know that using protection is very important, even for your computer. And Surfshark is truly one of the best VPNs in the game, and they also provide some of the best prices, which is a big reason why I like them. The app is very simple to use on any device. It just works in the background while still keeping your high-speed internet, which is kind of an issue I've had with other VPNs. You can also set which country you want to be online from, as if you're in that country, if a service you want to use isn't allowed in the country you're physically in. And one of my favorite features that pretty much only Surfshark offers is uses on unlimited devices. I use VPNs all the time, especially for making videos. I'm always browsing the most random websites, trying to find content, clicking on random links. Even for editing, I'm always downloading a lot. So if you have been wanting a VPN or get a better one, Surfshark is offering anyone that uses my link, which is in the description, or just use my code, which is just my last name, Helmy, 83% off plus an additional three months on top of that. So thank you to Surfshark VPN for being the sponsor of this video. And let's get back now to the next weird way to make money. If the first one was not for you because exercise is out of the picture, this might be the perfect alternative. Cause there's a service out there called Cuddle Comfort where you can basically rent out your service of cuddling people. Strangers. It does seem like you can make a pretty good amount. Some people, they're charging 95 an hour, 100 an hour. This one is 400 an hour, okay. Who do you think you are for that? When I actually first found this website, I thought it was gonna be kind of dead that no one uses it, but the list of people in my area 
It is endless. There are so many people on this site. Well, let's look at some profiles and see what kind of things people have to offer. So this woman, she seems to charge 100 an hour and she's got a long list of rules for cuddling with me, which I feel like you have to have with this kind of thing. You have to be strict on your rules and set it straight from the beginning. Especially with things like this, you must be fully bathed and brush your teeth. It's sad that we have to even clarify that but with men, you, you just never know. This guy's profile, nurturing man. This looks like the kind of guy that would sign up for a cuddling website. He's got a YouTube video for his cuddling page. Let's find that out. Where's the poop? Really? If someone's backed up and constipated for two, three Bro, days- what is this ad? Why am I getting this ad? Hi, I'm Daniel, nurturing man on Cuddle I love to sum, I love to hug, I love to feel good. Nurturing touch, therapeutic touch, and also just listening or having a good, honest conversation. Sounds like a good time. Are there comments on this video? Do you travel to Vegas sometimes? I'm looking for the affection my father never gave me, but I live in Vegas. Wow, that's very sad. Another comment, just wondering how much your rates are. I also need to be held in a way that will help me cry. Cry out a lot of pains I have. Is that something you can handle? Jesus, this is sad, these comments. I mean, I guess in some way, the people that are gonna be renting out someone that wants to cuddle, I guess they are probably a pretty lonely kind of person. By the way, I don't wanna seem like I'm shaming anyone that does this or gets this service, cause I respect any kind of hustle that people do to get money. Um, and I guess in some way, it seems like people do need this. But of course, I wanted to actually test this for you guys, so I set up a profile set my rate and just like that I was ready to get requested a cuddle by random strangers. And if to this point everything I've said this seems like the kind of thing for you I have good news because just signing up a couple days I already have requests for people to want to cuddle with me. Unfortunately it has all been men that has requested for me. Let's look through some of the messages that I got. I got this one. This was one of the first messages I got. He says how's it going? If you could ever host and open to being a pro cuddler, let me know. I can't host and would show my thanks and appreciation each time we chilled with a donation for your time and use of your place. If not, when I travel to Phoenix for work, I would have a room to chill in. He's not just trying to cuddle with me, he's also just trying to use my place as an Airbnb. And we would just be hanging out and cuddling when he's in, in town. Another message I got, hey man, I'm brand new to this. Mostly straight, 37 from Scottsdale. Never tried platonic cuddling, but down for it sometime. What are you looking for with it? Just found this site by accident today. Interesting wording this guy used. He mostly straight and he found this site by accident. I don't know how you accidentally find this site. This is kind of something you really have to search for. Well anyway, just being on this site just a week, it seems like I already have potential clients if I did want to start my cuddling business. Personally, I think I'm going to pass on this, but if it's for you, there's definitely potential on this website. Let's move on to an actual good way to make money though. and. This one is a little bit less jokey, but it really might be the best way out of all my videos to actually make some money. Because as I searched online for weird ways to make money, a lot of websites came up and said you can make a good amount by just becoming a dog walker for people. This idea definitely has a lot of potential because so many people have pets and some people might not have the time to actually take their dog for a walk, but they still wanna get their dog exercise or just more entertainment. Nowadays, there's actually specific apps that are built just for things like this. The most popular ones are WAG and Rover, which both directly connect you to people that are searching for this kind of thing. And it's not just walking dogs. You're able to maybe watch people's dogs while they're out on a vacation. So to test this, I signed up for one of those services. The only annoying part to just sign up you need to pay $30 just to put your services up. And the good news about this app is that just a few days after signing up, I immediately got two people requesting for me to watch their dogs and bring them over here. And for not a bad price, one request I got, it was a 10 day stay at my place that pays almost $300. Which again, it's like a dream job, being paid to just hang out with a dog. This one was so cute too, it was a Shiba. But unfortunately, I didn't actually end up accepting this one because I thought about it 
And because I rent this place, I thought I maybe would have to be worried about my landlord actually seeing that I have a dog. So because of that, I turned my services to dog walking only and the requests didn't come in as fast as you would like, but eventually, I finally got a request and I accepted. It was really easy to set up. We discussed when they want their dog walked and just like that, I was out walking this beautiful German Shepherd named Danny and she is such a good girl. Just after one walk, I love her already. And one thing that I really didn't take into account is how healthy it would be for me because it's only a 30 minute walk but I was jogging for some of it and I'm getting exercise not only for her but for me as well. So for this video, I usually like to put in a lot of more weird, jokey type ways to make money, but this is actually one that you can actually have a good side hustle doing this. Personally, I would much prefer to be walking like five people's dogs for three hours over cuddling a strange man for an hour. But that's just my, that's just my personal preference. Next one, now this one would also kind of be a dream job if you can find people to buy your service because you essentially get paid to just play video games. And you could do that because there is a website called epal.gg where you can offer to play video games with lonely gamers. And I actually don't think it needs to be video games. I think you can even just talk to them. They even have an emotional support section, which I guess is nice, but I don't know if random gamers are necessarily the best to get emotional support from. I guess if it's not that serious, but for the most part, it's mostly just gaming from every game you can play, which I do think that there is a market out there for people because gamers can be lonely. I even found this Reddit thread from this guy, lonely gamer wondering how do you find people to play and talk about games with? And this site is essentially the solution to that question. You just gotta pay for friends. So after being on this website for about a week, I'll be honest, if you're a guy trying to make money from this, I think it's gonna be a bit more of an uphill battle compared to women on this site. From what I've seen, it seems like a lot of the girls on this site have a lot more reviews than the guys. Or maybe I'm just saying this because I'm a bit bitter because I've been on this site with my services available for an entire week and not one person has requested to play a game for me and I'm cheap. I put, I think the lowest they can be, I put $2 for 30 minutes and still no one. Anyway, I still wanted to bring it up for this video. I think if I maybe even put more effort into my profile cause you have to even put a recording for people that want to request you. And I don't think mine was very good. Pay me and I'll play ball guys with you. Yeah, I don't know if that was maybe the best thing to put on my profile. I do seem a bit greedy, like I don't really care, I just care about the money, but I'm being honest. And finally, the last way we're gonna go over to make money, and like always, I save the weirdest for last. Because we all know how popular feet pictures have become online, so now there's a specific website, not only fans, but specifically to sell pictures of your feet called Feet Finder. Feet Finder is the safest and easiest website to view, buy, and sell custom feet pics and videos. I believe this is the most popular website to do this kind of thing, and just looking through the options, I'm just window shopping. They have a lot of different categories that you can pick from. ASMR, chubby feet, dirty feet, humiliation. One category is even food. What is this one? I've never heard of that. Ew, chocolate feet. Now, I will say, if you do do this, you do have to become creative with what you put out because there's a lot of people selling feet pictures on this website. Like everything else in this video, I'm here to personally test these weird ways to make money for you guys. So I did a photo shoot and took my own pictures that, you know, feet pictures, I don't really care to have them exposed online. It's not really something I care about. So I set my profile, uploaded my pictures, and my account has been running for a few days now. I have yet to get a sale though. But, you know, like I said, there is a lot of competition. I'll probably get one eventually. One of you, to be honest, is now probably going to buy my feed pictures, which I would not suggest because I did not put effort into this. But in general, clearly if you put in some effort, unlike me, it seems like it is possible to make money from this. I found someone that actually has made money from this site and they said that they've made almost 5,000 a month. 
I feel like that's very rare to be making that much, but I guess it's possible because people are freaky out there about feet. So there you go, that's where I'm gonna wrap up this video. Five or six ways that you can start your new side hustle and be on your way to financial wealth because of me. I actually genuinely wonder with these videos a lot of times if anyone actually takes these ways and tries them for themselves. If you sign up for the cuddle one, actually please let me know because it really, I, again, I don't wanna shame anyone that does it, but it really does take a certain kind of person to be comfortable in that kind of thing. But with that, that's where I'm gonna wrap up this video. Thank you again to Surfshark for being the sponsor of this video. Also, look out in the next few days. I hopefully wanna be live streaming a couple days after this video comes out. So turn on notifications if you don't wanna miss that. I've really been enjoying streaming. I just love the interaction with the chat. Also, one thing that I wanna shout out more that I don't as much as I should, I wanna do another P.O. Box opening video. So if you wanna send me anything, it's gonna be in the description. Even just letters, I love getting and reading them. In fact, I checked my box a couple weeks ago and I don't know if this is one of those joke packagings, but someone sent me this. I'm not gonna open it in this video smellmythongs.com. If this is real, I don't even know what to say. I feel like it's one of those joke packagings, but hey, look forward to the next PO Box opening video where I open that and find out. Ooh, a kitty appearance. Kitty, say hi. Hello. Yeah. Anyway, thank you guys for making it to the end of this video. I love you guys, and hopefully I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>